Praise God. Yes, um, another vibe for you about Jesus Christ. Beloved, aha, God didn't want to scare you and me, right? Why am I saying this? And actually, when I mean God didn't want to scare you, I mean Jesus didn't want to scare us by saying, I am God. When he revealed himself as the flesh and image of God, listen attentively right here because there is nothing arguing right now in our days that Jesus is Lord. He came for his people, but his people didn't know him and they didn't, they didn't even believe in him. But for us who are very uh, insightful and very, very uh, spiritual, right, and having discerning spirit, knows that there is no doubt that Jesus is Lord or oh God. Listen right here, according to Isaiah 7, verse 14. And before I read Isaiah 7, verse 14, in the chapter 9, the verse 6, the Bible made us know that a son was born. Right? And who was that son? He will be called advisor, great advisor, a king, you know, ruler, whatever of you. And let me go and read according to Isaiah. Beloved, we as Christians should be very careful and we should know that when we say Jesus Christ is Lord or God, it is not a blasphemy, right? It is nothing said dangerous or risky that you have never heard before because he is God and he is Lord. So according to Isaiah 7 verse um, 14, listen here. Listen. Therefore, the Lord himself will give you a sign. Listen again. Listen, the Lord himself will give you a sign. Beloved, who is Lord? I have said it on countenance and numerous times that when we say Lord in the uh, 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 old Testament, we are meaning God. And many in the New Testament, after Jesus ascended, we also got to know that Jesus is also accumulated or related to the name Lord. When we say Lord, we mean Jesus. Then what dispute the fact that Jesus Christ is God? Because in the Old Testament, Lord means God. And in the New Testament, we, we, we came to know that Lord Jesus is also term as God. Lord is Jesus. And so Jesus means God because Lord is God. Right. So he said, Lord himself will give you a sign before he was born. He was called God and Lord in the heavens. So there is nothing that people can dispute about this fact. I just want you to know the truth. From today onwards, don't be naive or don't be upset when somebody says Jesus Christ is God or Lord. That is said. And I, myself, I have witnessed. Hmm? Spiritual inclined people don't dispute this fact. He will scare you 
when you was to say, I am God, I am up there, and I've come down for you to believe that I was the one. No. And you know, God is all-knowing. He is omniscient. He is very intelligent and wisdom is his name. He is the origin of wisdom. So he is able to do anything. He is omnipresent too. So he can be up there and be here. So the time that we were crucifying him, you know, there's no wonder about how he resurrected. Jesus Christ is God. Amen. My name, Evangelist Osu Michael. I will say bye-bye to you. Shalom.